issue there with the um, software. I'm just gonna keep moving. Um, luckily, uh, it's pretty fast to actually. I'm gonna just run away from this and we'll deal with not having to untangle. Then we're we'll heading into the crystal room. They were all healed up. Still. Yeah. Let's give this a go and see how it goes. I commend your effort with your excursion ends here. You will never get the crystal. You cannot defeat me with those weapons. We shall see. Let me carry the weight. Can you withstand this? Oh my. All at once? Oh boy. We stand no chance. I need my sword. Ugh. If only I could use my sword. Indeed. Cecil. Where are you going? Where are you going? You're in no condition to move. I'm alright. I just want to get my heart to... Ugh. Please, return to your bed. I must help them. So somehow he just knew here, but... Twin harp sounds the melody from Edward's harp. This melody, it's Edward. Da, ah, what's this torturous, torturous sound? Indeed, he cannot control the field while I'm while I'm playing. Now draw your sword. All right. So, we actually get an opportunity to equip here, which is nice. Um, and, okay, we'll need to unequip this first, I suppose, before we, we can put on sword again. Yeah. Let's the Paladin's Helm. Paladins on the armor. Paladins gloves and the paladins uh, shield. Okay, that's good. Uh, let's equip Sid uh, as well and see if there's anything else we can give him. Nothing of real worth, I don't think, in here. Um, that's fine. Right, we'll just go ahead and fight here again then. You! Power attack. I guess we're just using Tello to heal here in this case. Actually, that's not too bad. Um, here we are. His attacks are not nearly as effective right now. 
Um, except for that, I suppose. Oh boy. Um, whisper. Oh, don't turn me into a pig. Jeez. Two. Two. Ice two. I guess we're still doing a lot of damage there, so that's probably fine. We do want to keep Cecil alive though, so here two. If I'm gonna have to beat him as a pig, I'll beat him as a pig, but uh, say your prayers. What's that now? Oh boy. Dark dragon. Um, oh boy. That's more worrisome. Um, Breath. Oh boy. Oh no, oh no. Okay, do we have any more life spells at all somehow? Light. Yeah, that's probably for Yang as well. Jesus. I don't have enough healing! Oh boy. Come on, Sid, you can do it. You can do it. Oh boy. Yeah, this is pretty awkward here. We might be a bit underleveled here. Oh boy, yeah. Annihilated. Yeah, okay. So I guess we're spending a little bit of time uh, fighting enemies here. Hey, at least you can see the initial loading uh, screen here. Nice little extra surprise. So, luckily we're not going to be losing a lot of time here, but. We may want to. Yeah, that's just not the encounter I want. Okay, here we got the exit. That's fine. We'll fight there. So I actually study the vampire or bats here, so or K bats I guess. We'll see what they're up to. Weak as holy. Huh. Weak against project. <laughs> Don't think we have any of those. We're gonna stand here and just use uh, our uh, spells. We may want to just start using uh, our uh, highest level fire spells here, I suppose. To tell them if we're going to be using the tens anyway. Um, yeah, fire three. Probably take care of most enemies here. In this cave system. And then we'll 
heal with Cecil and then head back towards the save room. Yang level up. Nice. Counter we wanted, that's fine. We're good to go. So it's alive here. Attack the ogre. Oh, hi. Is that a crit? It seemed like a crit, but I'm not entirely sure. And we're just very uh, wrong with that particular. I guess he's spreading the overs with our best weapons here. For some reason. Yeah, I guess we are. So that sort of changes things a little bit here. Yeah. He's a tent. I'm not sure we need that prompt every time we stand on it, but we'll take it. Um, are good enough for now. Let's head out and fight some more. And this will probably be a boring part of the vault here, but it's important to uh, keep uh, going here, I think. So. Fire two on this one of these, will that do the trick better? I wonder. Wait, I suppose. Um... I'm not sure how many. Arrows we have left here for that, that's fine. Here we are. 
Let's try to get a few more levels on Assassin Red, at least. Yeah, these are not levels at all, really. Being a bit trigger happy on uh, getting to the spell menu there, so. Huh. Pythons aren't actually doing much of everything here, I think. This is probably the easiest uh, encounter I've ever by quite a lot actually, so... Should get a few levels on some of our characters, I think. Um... Just leveled up. Is it just him? Okay, it's fine. Uh, uh, to his next level, around 4000. So that's probably gonna be a little while. Um, I think one was 400 is one battle. 10,000 is quite a while this way. Um, yeah, let's try to get to 22 with Cecil at least, I think. I'm not sure if that's going to be the thing that makes the difference, but you know, it's a it's a goal, and we can you know check in and we'll see how we are stacking up against where we should be at for the boss here. Yeah, one more fight here uh, before we take another pill. Uh, nah, in the cave. Sort of the first real time I think we needed to do any significant amount of grinding here. We've obviously done a bit to um, get um, 
we really leveled up when we got there the first time around. Uh, oh yeah, that's that's the stuff. That's the tickets. Yeah, that's that's what we like to see. Save level up. Nice. We'll head in and we'll have a nap. But this is the first time I think we've been for a uh, you know, pure power level uh, reasons that we found ourselves doing a bit of grinding. Um, which isn't necessarily a bad thing, you know, it's a thing that's of its time a little bit. And uh, this isn't, you know, too much of an imposition at uh, this point here. Actually, let's actually save here as well. Just in case anything real bad should happen. I don't want to lose the levels. Um... Here we are. Let's rewrite the data. Gives me a little chance to refill my last here as well. Sitting here talking to you guys while uh, playing dust, marching a little bit. Um, not too bad, of course, but and I am glad to do it. But it's always nice to have something to with the purple a little bit, uh, keep uh, me in decent position here, please. There we are, ambush. Oh no. Oh boy. That's fine. We're using the same amount of MP anyway, it's just that you know, it would be more effective if we had actually, you know, potentially killed both of them here. Not really made much of a difference here, but. It's all fine at the end of the day. I think it's, I think, another fight, and we'll probably have a level on Yang. Here we are. Yes. Um, I feel like a lot of my play by play commentary and spread being while playing here just comes down to be like, oh, who am I healing right now? Which I'm not sure if it's a playstyle thing or if it's something that's, you know, actually a common uh, pattern for mo most players here, but. Two will do. Fight the snakes. Yes, please. Stop in yourself. Stop in yourself. Yes. Yang leveled up. Yeah, another battle here too, and we'll uh, 
Takže to tam. Speedgun. Probably. My main problem here again is that, you know, with so many enemies on, on the screen during their attacks, it just takes a long time for us to get to the point where we can finish the battle here. That's fine. We'll probably be able to finish them off here with the Ice Ball. This takes a long time to cast as well. Really? Okay, that's fine. Um, are we out of air soon? We probably are. Go. Yeah, that's out of arrows. Again, probably not the most riveting uh, of uh, gameplay here, but hopefully we'll be able to dish this up and move past this pretty soon here. So, yeah. a couple more levels would be nice. I really have no life around here, basically. Oh, we forgot. Um, it would be good to get that sort of for the next encounter here so we know that we will have enough arrows if we find any more uh, bats. Go. I forgot again. Oh boy. Yeah. I really am horrible at uh, remembering to do what I say I'm gonna do. Some of the combat messages here are not, you know, very clear in, in terms of what the actual effect is to me here. Um, I guess that's sort of showed me, I suppose. It says leveled up, nice. Um, so, how much more? There we have race. Tell a little. We 
yarn. Yeah, obviously this build's called Life Yarn, but I'm, you know, used to some of the uh, other translations of the beast spells from other games here, so please bear with me if I'm being a bit confusing or obtuse here, but... Now, this time, let's remember to equip those arrows. Uh, ice, yes, yes. One more battle there. Actually, how many feet do we need? Four and a half thousand. It's probably not too bad. Exact that uh, Yang's doing so much damage to the ogres. No, no, no. Really? No, oh boy. That's fine. This means a bit less experience for Ella, and that's not going to be the end of the world, but. That's a bit annoying, to be honest. Um. Exit and go and sleep with them in. Does the let's say yeah, let's give this a go. Um, I wonder if the cabin actually raises uh, characters as well. If that's the case, we may need to use the bite up bullet, but um, I guess we need Tella here. But um, yeah, that was quite an unfortunate little. Innocent death or is it KO spell that they threw at us there at the very end? Those corals are quite annoying, actually. Let's see here. Uh, So Kevin gets a separate little sprite here as well. That does actually raise him. Okay. That's good to know. Let's not have to deal with that again, hopefully here. Uh, 
Let's heal. Let's heal again. And let's be satisfied like that. that they were all gonna attack before us here. That's, that's actually, they may actually mean that they are all going to attack before us here. They aren't supposed to be uh, weak against ice, but I feel like Cecil's doing more with ice arrows now than he did with fire arrows. Necessarily, but it seems to work out fine. There we are. Another few battles like that, and we should be 22. Sign of a boo. Um, that's probably one more fight. Two. Maybe two. It does seem a little bit unfair that we are not quick enough to get all our attacks up when we get a first strike, but the enemies definitely are. But yeah, that's the CPU advantage, I suppose. CPU privilege. Um, Level up. Okay, probably one more. Of course, that's still done. Again, no more corals and no more instant chaos, please. Now uh, that that we're happy to go along here. Actually, I'm in 15. Okay. It's fine. We can probably. With whatever it is, yeah. This is not too bad of an encounter. And we'll maybe we'll probably uh, just kill them all here. Yes. Here we are. Nice. 
Seth leveled up. Yang leveled up. Nice. Let's call that good for now then. Uh, we'll use a tent. No, we'll use a tent. Save, and then we'll give it this old uh, annoying F here another go. Yeah. Uh, if you come in directly into this video, I gave a story reading the other one uh, that happened before the streams before crashed here, so I may not go through it all. Uh, Again, this is will just speed through here. The short, long and short of it is that uh, we're gonna get bodied by the elf, and then Edward will help us uh, because he had it ported to give us a harp, basically. matter very much, but uh, go ahead. Just to take our damage and keep attacking a bit of one. There we go. Stand no chance. I need my sword. Ugh. Indeed. There we go. This is one of those things that feels a bit contrived. You know, it's very convenient that he just gave us our his heart. Or twin harp, uh, and then he decided to play music at the very right time, uh, for some reason. And that just happens to help against the uh, Dark Elf here. Not entirely sure why, but uh, we'll take it. Again, the story is definitely more of a focus here uh, than in previous games, even in more than Final Fantasy 2, but uh, it's definitely still a rough scenario over the overall. It's not necessarily Shakespeare. So we'll go into equipping things again. Um, yeah, we want to unequip the arrows. Put on our sword. Put on our Bullets. Put on our overall paladin kit here. Uh, the shield. There we go. That's probably good enough. Tell up. And we're gonna keep ourselves alive with him for now. Yeah, the window decker is really uh, annoying here actually. Go. 
Luckily we got the heal off before Yang got another. Health uh, issue there. Here we are. And that's what we did not want to see happen. Uh, can we just give him an elixir? Is that alright? Uh, where is the elixir? Please, 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 please. Actually, we cannot. Uh, um, and that's that. And. Yeah. Boy, that's a, a nasty, nasty attack. Let's just study it and see what we can learn here. Lots of HP. Weakness none. Well, that's awkward. Hmm. I wonder what we can do against the dark. Can we put up some... Um, White magic, perhaps, and with Tella, just to uh, help with the incoming damage. I'm assuming the Dark Breath is going to be a uh, special attack, not a magic attack. Um, so we may want to look into what we have in terms of dealing with something like that. Um, Full mute armor, a shell, wall spells. Dog's not gonna help us. Your four is maybe what we want in that case. Um, let's swap this around a little bit here. Here, but cure one, charm, and you scan things. Sight, berserk, wall, spell, haste, slow, shell, armor. Yeah, we'll, we'll give it a go. We'll see. We may just need to use a cure for. Give this whole battle, uh, yeah, a few more tries. Uh, if we can't beat it, we'll make sure to uh, just go ahead and do some additional grinding off stream here uh, before I continue tomorrow. So. Same old song and dance here again. Play the harp, bark. Uh, sorry. 
and that's the wrong character. Um, yeah, this whole song and dance with uh, trying to swap everything around is a bit annoying as well. Uh, it's not the cleanest uh, sort of preset we have to or we've ever done in terms of getting back to where we were, but. Give it another go. as much. Start casting Cure 4 and we'll probably... Oh, okay. Never mind. Actually, we'll just take it immediately. There we go, a much better pattern here. Now we can start thinking about seeing pure free and everyone. Should be much more doable. 300... That's true. Try using power attacks. Obviously, Cecil is the one we actually want to keep alive here since he's doing way more damage against this guy than everything else here. Um, but yeah, you can get the right attack pattern and suddenly it takes like much, much easier. So. There we are. We had an unlucky pattern here in the first two times, but that's sure is it. This cannot be with the crystal, my eternal life. Ah. Thank you, Edward. Let's grab this thing. Received Earth. There's something quaint about these, you know sort of terse uh, descriptions of some of these things. Uh, let's use exit here. C can we not? Can we... do we have to go out here? Surely we can use exit, right? There we go. There we are. Save this thing so we don't need to do that ever again. Or at least not for this uh, paper. Oh boy, that was... Again. Probably my least favorite uh, part of the early game here. But now it's done. We can move on. Uh, probably do a little bit of inventory management here. Once we get back to town, we're just gonna get back, we're gonna talk to the others, we're gonna talk to Edward and we'll see about meeting up and grabbing our girlfriend. Oh, just fired straight back. Okay. That's fine. Can we just grab a yellow sugar ball? No, that's not. Hello, 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 hello. Please, please. Please, please. What about the white? That's pretty white. MP restored. Oh, hey. Um. Oh, whoa, get ya. There we go. Let's 
the more classic uh, chocobo theme here. It's not nice to get a different theme for different chocobos. Uh, cool. Let's leave there. Yeah, let's head into the castle. Have a little chat with the elders here. Oh my goodness! The Earth Crystal indeed! How the hell do you... Three chairs! Banzai! It's about time, Cecil. Oh my. Who the hell? Kane! Bring the crystal and board your ship. I'll take you to Rosa. Who the heck was that? They're quite aggressive in borrowing uh, the crystal here, I feel. Feel free to take the items of the underground store. Yes, please. If it wasn't the wrong hand, who knows what could happen to it? Yep. Yeah. 